Alicia Gross. I am a local model, fitness enthusiast, and yogi, and I am returning as your host for this week's episode of Fayetteville 180, presented by Cape Fear Valley Health. First, we are here at Camping World to talk about the Duck Derby. I have Johnny Wilson with Fayetteville Urban Ministry and Donnie Blands, who is with Camping World. Johnny, can you let us know a little more about this event? Yes, it's a wonderful event. We've been doing this for six years now, and now we're part of the Fayetteville Dogwood Festival. Wow. And we're gonna race these ducks, the corporate ducks, our sponsors, they're gonna race first in the Cross Creek Festival Park, and then after that, the little duckies will race for the marquee that Donnie would tell us about here. This year our grand prize is a 25-foot Coleman travel trailer. Coleman's the oldest name in camping and this year we're offering something different. We've got one that's 25 foot with a slide out. So come on out this Sunday and be a part of the Duck Derby. And all proceeds will go to Fayetteville Urban Ministry and our local nonprofits. Don't forget to go to FayettevilleDuckDerby.com and adopt your ducks today. Hey everyone, it's springtime and we're here in Festival Park for the Dogwood Festival. I'm joined with members of the band Radio Box, Brandon, Morell, and Dominic. Can you all let us know a little bit about your music? Well, I play the bass. I play keys. I play drums. Um, we play all styles of music from jazz, hip hop, country, rock and roll. Uh, we try to do it all. Amazing. Now, can you let us know, Dominic, when can the fans come out and watch you? We're going to be out here on Sunday at 3.30, so you guys come on out. And Morell, where can everyone find information about your music? Uh, you can check us out on Facebook, like our page, Radio Box. We also have an Instagram. You can also come check us out on Wednesdays at Fat Daddy's. We host an open mic. Very, very cool. Come on out and check these guys out. For more information about Radio Box or the Dogwood Festival, please visit FayDogwoodFestival.com. In healthcare, we want to give more than we receive. We want to make a difference in someone's life and we want to bring caring and healing to those that are in need. Finally, we're here at Sweet Palette to talk about the Southeast Regional North Carolina Poetry Festival. I'm joined with LJ Bowens, who can give us a little bit more information about the festival. LJ, let us know what's going on with the Poetry Festival. The Southeast Regional North Carolina Poetry Festival was founded by some of the local artists here in the city. This festival involves workshops along with other events, along as open mics, and we also cap it off with a poetry slam, which will involve the youth ages 14 through 19 who will be competing in this event as well. Really, really nice. Now, where does the Poetry Festival kick off? Well, it kicks off this Thursday through Sunday, and it will begin at Methodist University, along with the Big Apple Restaurant, Sweet Palette, Main Library Branch in downtown Fayetteville, and we'll all end at the rock shop. Very nice. Now, if poets want to sign up, how can they sign up? The poets can definitely go to our Facebook page and they can sign up there, which is located at Southeast Regional North Carolina Poetry Slam. Very nice. We'll see you all at the festival. We're out of time. Remember to visit fay180.com for next Tuesday's episode when we will fill you in on more events happening in our community. I'm Aquisha Gross. Have a great week.